guys assalamualaikum everyone uh, welcome again to our channel uh, the feel arab fam uh, ngayon po guys uh, may pag-uusapan na naman tayo kasi sabi ko gagawa ni ko ito ng video para maliwanagan po yung lahat okay kasi uh, may nagtanong kasi sa akin sa yt sa youtube na question then sinabi ko why not i will try to make a video for this para maliwanagan po yung lahat okay so ngayon pag-uusapan natin yan ngayon okay then let's start Pag-uusapan natin ngayon guys about sa question ng isang kababayan natin na nakapag-asawa din ng Arab. Ganyan po. Uh, so, thank you so much sa question nyo. And nakagawa ako ng video to clarify this all. Okay? Ngayon, uh, just to clarify, pag-uusapan natin regarding the, uh, her questions. Ito yung question natin niya na, <clears throat> I'm sorry. Ito yung question niya. Salamalaikum sis, ask ko lang why you are holding ikama if you legalize your marriage certificate here in KSA. Then whether second or third and fourth wife for Saudi citizen holding Hafiza ID, yes. Holding for for Saudi citizen, ikama for non Saudi for those foreigners who didn't get national citizen as Saudi but married to Saudi. Yes, of course it's true. Okay, ngayon pa pag uusapan natin yan. Ah, uh, to answer this question, sis, ah, uh, ganito yan siya. Uh, our marriage was legalized here, right? But I am not kasi staying here in Saudi for a long time. For those married Saudis, for those wife na married Saudis for a long time, they can apply and get a nationalities, right? Sa akin naman po, I am not kasi staying here in Saudi for a long time. Kailangan kasi at least you are staying here five years up para makakuha ka ng nationality. Then, you can get the passport also as well. But, uh, not guarantee po yan siya. You need to apply for it kasi you cannot predict the rules. Rules is rules. Yan po. And also, uh, very difficult kasi yung rules nila. Kaya sinasabi ko na not guarantee. And hindi po kami nag-apply kasi nga I am not staying here for a long time. Kailangan kasi hindi ka mag uh, hindi ka mag vacation. You are not traveling. You are not going to out in the country for five years. Ganyan. To go home or like that for your family. And then, for me kasi, uh, I need to go home kasi may mga works din ako kami doon. Right? So, uh, that is why uh, I am going and coming only here kasi I am not staying here for a long time. Yun po. And so, for those Filipina na nagstay here for a long time, maybe they got it, the nationality for those for a long time but for me uh, i didn't get it and i am not offering also for that and now uh, hindi lang naman ako yung walang nationality even though i have i am married sa saudi kasi there are Saudis also, Saudi people na wala ding nationalities, not just me. May mga Saudis din na walang nationalities, guys. Okay? And I don't know, I couldn't explain it further. They are the one knows and I am not the government to tell, to say it. And 
You know naman, the rules in Saudi is strict. So, rules is rules. This is kingdom. Okay? The, the government, the one knows for all. So, for me, maybe if I try to stay here for five years, four years, they will give me. But still, not guarantee. Yun po. And also, uh, bakit nga po ikama lang? Yan po, yan po yung sagot ko. Bak ikama lang kasi I am not staying here for a long time. And ikama kasi dahil yan yung passes natin dito sa Saudi. Whether you are a workers or a Saudi wife, it is just like pretty much like lang na national ID but it's not a national ID. But nandun po lahat. It's an ID po, pero nandun lahat yung uh, information nyo sa ID na yan. And connected yan siya sa Abshir dito kasi electronic nga. Gaya nga ng sinabi ko, hindi po sila basta-basta nagbibigay ng nationality here. Kasi they have the strict guidelines po na rules dito. This is kingdom. And also, regarding the nationality, I am not naman after as long as na-add na po ako sa ID ng husband ko. That's the important. And my kids, they, ang sa akin naman is, I am not after for the nationality for now. Kasi, hindi din ako makastay for long time here. It's depend na po if alas will na makastay ako here and they will give me a nationality, I will be honored and blessed to have it. Yan po. Pero it's not guarantee pa rin. Kasi difficult talaga yung rules nila. Gaya nga ng sinabi ko, uh, it's not just me as a Saudi wife ang um, wala. Few only, those Saudi na nag-married ng, ng, I mean, those Filipina na nag-married ng Saudi. And they stayed here for a long time. Right? And the important naman guys eh, na as long as you are, your marriage was legalized here in Saudi and you are a Saudi citizen's wife, you are not a holder of any ikamas na working and uh, you are already uh, holding an, an ikama na Saudi citizen's wife, yun po yung importante. Kasi don't expect po na you will go beyond that and get the nationality kasi strict talaga sila. And the important naman for me is na add na ako and uh, yung mga bata uh, na add sa family ID, uh, they are Saudi citizens. Yun, yun naman ang importante. For me, no problem po sa akin. Yun po. As long as you are a holder of ikama na Saudi citizen's wife and the important is na add ka na sa Saudi family ID and you are part of the family. Yan po. And legalize yung marriage nyo dito sa Saudi. And don't expect na po yung nationality kasi mahirap talaga. And gaya nga ng sinabi ko kanina, kailangan mo munang magstay dito 5 years and up. So kasi yan po yung uh, parang rules na din nila, rules. And pwede kang mag-apply pero without vacation. Gaya nga ng sabi ko sa iyo, without vacation, without traveling, without going home. So ganyan po. And ma-travel pa naman ako na tao. So, hindi talaga siya, ano, uh, pwede na makastay ako ng long time here. Maybe, insya Allah, if, if Allah's will talaga na magstay na ako dito, why not, ba diba? So, I would love to have that nationality. And I'll try if Alice will and the government give me that nationality. But for now, uh, I am not aftering for that. 
And also pala guys, malay nyo pala, uh, they won't give you that years, like 5 years, uh, hindi sila magbibigay. So, wala pa rin. So, you need to stay pa rin until you can get that nationality or malay mo pala until 8 or 10 years pa or more than that. So, it's long time. You're gonna wait it for long time. So, yan po. Kasi nga, uh, strict talaga sila. Very difficult. Kaya, it's okay that you don't have nationality here. As long as you ha you are a holder of ikama as Saudi citizen's wife at Anytime, you can go and come. Going and coming only. So, and you are part of the family. You are added sa Saudi ID ng family. So, yun po guys. O, oh, ba? So, approval nga, ba Mahirap. How much more? And balay mo pala, i-reject nila every time na nag apply ba? So, Gaya ng approval, maraming na-reject, maraming na-failed, maraming hindi na-approve. So, mahirap talaga. So, you cannot predict, guys, the rules. So, for those nakakuha ng Filipina na nag-stay dito for long time, na kaya nila na mag-stay dito for long time, uh, alhamdulillah, uh, good for all of you. And nakaya nyo na magstay here for a long time. So, alhamdulillah. And hopefully, inshallah, if I will stay here for a long time, alhamdulillah, makaya ko din. So, yun po, guys. And it is not easy din, guys. And very difficult talaga kasi it is the rules eh. And this is a kingdom, guys. Uh, you need to know that kingdom po ito. Okay? And also, uh, strict yung rules nila. Rules talaga is rules. So, we cannot predict po kasi sila po yung ha may hawak ng rules. And isa pa, guys, uh, yung approval nga, may, marami ng mahirapan sa pagkuha. How much more yung nationality? So... Uh, mahirapan talaga uh, they are not same with other countries na madali lang makakuha ng nationality even they stay for how many years that they can get it immediately hindi po ganyan kasi you know nagayan ng sinabi ko this is kingdom so very difficult talaga and you know naman iba't iba naman yung rules ng bawat country so ang rules po dito is difficult yan nga difficult po so, yun po guys. And ito nga pala yung ikama ko guys. Heto. And, ayan. And the family ID na sa husband ko po. Yung family ID. Kasi hindi ko naman pwede sabihin, give me your family ID. Mapapagalitan ako guys. Of course, daladala niya yan always. So, for those nakakaalam kung ano yung ikama, yung ikama is an ID, a resident permit. ID na naka-indicated doon lahat ng information mo sa ID na yan. Uh, gaya nga ng sinabi ko, whether you are a workers or a Saudi citizen's wife. Pero different naman po yung uh, workers and Saudi citizen's wife. Kasi yung workers, pag once na tapos na po yung contract nila, immediately po, deleted na yan sa system nila, electronic, cancel na po yan. Sa amin naman as uh, Saudi wives, continue po yan siya. Uh, renew ng renew lang po. Kasi may expiration din yung ikama ID. So, yun po guys. And we need to ah uh, Carry that anywhere when we travel uh, inside the country. Kasi uh, passes nga yan here in Saudi na you are holding a, you are holding a ikama, an ikama na to show and prove to them na meron kang ikama. Uh, that ikama ID, it is to legalize your stay here in Saudi uh, like for work like that and 
as a Saudi citizen's wife. Yun po. And different naman kasi kung for work naka-state yung ano nila, yung work nila sa ID na yan. And for Saudi citizen's wife, Saudi citizen's wife talaga ang naka-indicate sa ID. And free po yung free po kami makapunta anywhere. While yung ano naman yung may hawak na anong tawag nito? Ah uh, ikama na for work uh, makaka travel naman sila ganyan but it's not like free talaga kasi they have work they are not allowed na uh, to go beyond like us na Saudi citizens wife anywhere we can go coming going coming yan and sa kanila pag tapos na po yung contract nila wala na po yun Canceled na po yan siya. I-delete na po yan nila. So, wala na po silang ikama. Ang sa amin, continue naman, yun lang is, kailangan i-renew ng renew. Yun. Kasi may expiration din. Gaya nga ng sinabi ko, may expiration. And regarding the national ID, uh, yun nga yung sinabi ko earlier, the national ID is for uh, nakakuha ng nationality here. Yun, sa Saudi. And hindi po basta-basta. Kasi di, sabi, nga, sabi ko nga, very difficult po yung rules nila here. So, wag na lang po tayong mag-expect na bigyan tayo nila ng nationality. Yun po. As long as uh, legalized tayo here, anytime makapasok tayo, going, coming, and... Um, Legalize yung marriage natin and uh, na-add sa family ID. Yun, yun ang important din, na-add sa family ID. And yung sa mga bata naman, since their father is Saudi, so they are a Saudi citizen. Uh, immediate na po yun siya. Na Saudi citizens. Yun. Yun po. Hope clear po lahat. So, For now, this is only I can say. So hope, uh, sister, this made you clear my answer sa tanong niyo, and thank you so much sa tanong niyo, and may Allah bless us all. So bye, maasalama.